Welcome back to my channel. Been a long time. I shouldn't have left you. It was my birthday two days ago. I turned to 2-3-23. It's lit, okay? Hey, YouTube! Oh my god, yes. Welcome back to Abroad with Ori. Today, I thought I'd inform you guys that I am still living my best life. I am flying off to Iceland for my birthday. <laughs> Shout me. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a long time. The main thing is I'm sitting here on your screen, whether that's your phone or your laptop or your iPad or your TV. 2019, my first video of the year. <coughs> Excuse me. If you don't know already by the name of Rod with Ori, my channel is very travel based. That's why I thought we'd get to do a what's in my carry on travel essentials type video. So before I get into this video, I really want to shout out RJ Beauty Hair because can you see what lace? She slayed this hair. She did the colouring as well, the highlight. Every wig that you've probably seen me in the last year or whatever, I've made it myself. The last few people that I paid to do my hair did not do a good job. It was not well, I was okay. <laughs> someone is just walking past my window right now watching me. I was really hesitant to pay someone to do my hair because I'm really comfortable making my own wig. I thought, let me, like, it's my birthday, I want to treat myself. And she came through, like, I wore this for my birthday dinner, like, two days ago. I'll insert pictures so you can see the, the look that, you know, I had going on. My friends were literally like, oh, is that a friend? Oh my god, is that leave out? I was like, bitch. Bitch, this is a closure, and yeah, just wanted to shout her out because she actually deserves it. Like, plus, she's a very lovely girl, anyway. Let's get into the video. <laughs> it feels so fun to be filming again. Like, I feel like I haven't filmed in months, that's why I'm just a bit overexcited and i feel like because it's a new year it's a new age i'm 23 i'm about to fly i'm going to iceland i just feel like i'm in such a good mood like it's lit yes so <laughs> what in my carry on this is the bag that i have i always normally go with like my michael kors handbag i wanted to have a rucksack this time it's more convenient like i have my hands free i can vlog more easily i just feel like it's easier to have the weight across your whole back rather than just hanging down on one shoulder but i feel like this one is very very cute very chic i got it from asos 20 pounds on sale got this little furry bit at the back so bloody cute this is the bag i'm gonna be traveling with today let me also show you the look i'm wearing a tracksuit it's not any special tracksuit this cost me 12 pounds it was from primark top was seven pounds the bottoms five pounds yeah, I like to be comfy when I'm on the plane. I will go for like a tracksuit normally or like leggings and like a hoodie. I don't really wear jeans. I want to get like a really cute Insta picture. I always go to the airport and I don't get these cute Insta pics that I'm seeing other people get. That's my plan. I need to get a cute Insta picture with my suitcase, with my fit. I'm going to be wearing my white Air Forces with this. My face is very simple. Eyebrows, foundation and mascara and that's it. Quite a basic look. More time if I'm flying. I don't wear makeup because i'm filming for you guys i want to get my cute airport picture it's basically my birthday week i thought i might as well just do a cheeky slay you know not too much but a cheeky one also look at the nails these are my birthday nails like tradition i like to go away every single year for my birthday my 19th yeah for my 19th i went to amsterdam um where did i go for my 20th i went to tenerife i think nah I think I'm getting this wrong. Yeah, no, 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 no. No, wait, I'm actually lost. No, you are so dumb. You are really dumb. For real. Then, bear with me. Okay, I figured it out. So for my 20th, Amsterdam. For my 21st, Tenerife. For my 22nd, as you might know, I was living in Barcelona and my friends flew over. I don't have a lot of time because my flight is in like five hours. Let's get into what's in my carry-on. Most of my, my, my clothes and everything are gonna be in the check luggage with makeup and everything. So this is just like what I'm gonna take on the plane with me. I like to take a bum bag. I wear this to the airport and I wear it whilst I'm like walking around. I can keep my passport in here, put my name 
name, Lori. And I also have like my phone, my bank card, my lip gloss. This is my go-to lip gloss, NYX. I feel like a beauty influencer right now. NYX Butter Gloss in Madeline. You know when you're walking around and you want to go shopping duty-free, they always want to see your um, boarding pass and stuff. When you get to board the plane, they want to see your passport. I feel like it's easier to have it in here rather than like, having to go in my bag like every 10 minutes to get it out. Very, very convenient. My phone is really essential when I'm traveling too. My phone is very, very organized. So I have like a travel folder. I always like to have my boarding passes on the app. Today I'm going to be flying with EasyJet. So I have my EasyJet app ready. My boarding pass is already on here. I have Netflix on here. You can download movies, download shows, whatever, whatever. And I'll just watch it on my phone when I'm on the plane. So I forgot to explain this in the video, but I also have these two pop sockets on the back of my phone that make it so much easier to be able to stand my phone up and watch movies on the plane. So I don't know what to watch on Netflix, I'll just go on Twitter. You know on Twitter everyone's like recommending something to watch on Netflix. I'm just gonna look for something quickly. I think I'm gonna watch The Good Neighbor. I've seen like a couple people like tweet about it. So yeah, I'm gonna download that. Mm -hmm. Headphones are essential. It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. Well, let's be nice. Yeah. Let's be nice. We don't have to go there. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong, but you didn't have to say it. I mean, good Lord. Hide the money, y'all. There's poor people around. <laughs> With your broke ass. <laughs> <laughs> I have Spotify. I might just want to listen to music when I'm in the airport or when I'm on the plane or whenever. Then I just have like some toiletries. So I got these babies, wipes, tissues because you know, you just might need a tissue. <laughs> hand cream for when my hands start to go gray and dry. I bought this yesterday, a mini brush slash mirror. Handy, compact. Then I've got these babies, which are kind of new to my airport routine. Cause I've just been like, seeing a lot about how drying and damaging drying can be for your skin. A face mask. Me and my friend Abby, shout out Abby. Just saying that we're gonna, we're gonna introduce face masks to our post flight ritual. This was recommended to me by Rihanna. Shout out the travel plug. It's a face mist, which is also really good for like rehydrating, revitalizing your skin. I have some painkillers because you just never know when you're gonna need them. I have some snacks. I can't lie to you guys, I'm not healthy. But I got some snacks for the plane. Quavers, I love Quavers. Snickers, this is literally my favorite chocolate bar ever. Just some Harry Bows, fantastic. I also have water, and you're not allowed to take anything over 100 mil past security. I try to like drink a lot of water, so I always take a, a bottle of water to the airport and I'll just drink it on the way there or like before security. So, you know, I'm getting my, my two liters or whatever and just, you know, just drinking my water and minding my own business. That's what I'm trying to do. Chewing gum. Um, obviously I bring my charger I like to bring my portable charger just very convenient if my phone is dying I can just whip it out and like charge it I also like to have an adapter that matches the city that I'm going to the Iceland adapter is literally the same as like most of the European ones I don't know where it is it was around here somewhere I'll insert a picture of it but I'm sure you guys well most of you guys should know what it looks like I like to bring my fluffy sock when I get on a plane I can just take off my shoes and get comfy I feel like plays can be very very cold when I have these socks I know that I'm gonna be comfy and I'm gonna be good as I said I'm going to Iceland so I'm bringing up some cozy stuff as well I have this hat I'm gonna try it on for you guys yeah this is it just a cute little hat Primark two pounds if I step off the plane and it's freezing I can just pop this on I'm gonna check the weather okay so currently it's three degrees in Iceland but London is five degrees right now so it's not a massive difference I think it's gonna snow tomorrow actually let me double check yeah it should be snowing like tomorrow and the day after and the day after and we're there three days that's why I got this hat I got some gloves I can only find one but literally the other one's around here somewhere <laughs> I got this snood as well I'm Oh, oh, I found the other glove. Let me tie this up. Some bread. Oh, <laughs> I'm pressed for time. That's why I'm rushing. Oh my god, why won't this stay? I'm gonna lose it. It's staying. 
Okay, yeah, so I have this umbrella because weather is unpredictable. It's saying it's gonna snow. It says it's raining now. Apparently by the time we land, it won't be raining, but you just never know. I'd just rather have an umbrella on me than not have one and then get soaked. I also bought these bags from TK Maxx. I'm gonna like quickly put like my wipes and everything, my hand cream into the clear one. The clear one's like convenient because I can see exactly what I'm looking at and stuff. Just so that I can keep everything organized. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. I'm gonna be posting and all of my pictures from the trip on there. I'm only posting my Blue Lagoon pics. Like, I can't wait to go and take my pictures. You know I love my pictures. I do, all right? I do like my pictures. I ain't afraid to say it, all right? Stay tuned to the content I'm gonna be posting from Iceland. I don't feel like my hand luggage is perfect. Like, it's perfect for me, but I know some people say that you should always travel with, like, bare underwear and stuff in case you don't get your checked luggage. Like, fingers crossed, nothing happens. But I'll just take what, what I need in it and then just hope that nothing goes wrong. I'm considering taking my laptop. I haven't decided yet. That's why I haven't shown it. But if I do, it does fit in this bag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.